Except being targeted for being too like. What part of it's supposed to be for? No.
to interrupt your cryo sleep, but I thought it worth mentioning that I, your digital officer during emergencies, or Dottie, have detected an alien biorhythm on this ship. And just as I suspected, the aliens have uploaded a virus, which is slowly deleting my program. Do you require guidance? Coke Zero! That's kind of funny. They're usually an alien. I'm now initiating security protocol Tango Tango Cash, which is a series of tests designed to evaluate your humanity and reveal any aliens hiding amongst you. I have determined that two of you are secretly aliens. Please look at your device and confirm your identity. Your device can tell you if you're a human or an alien, but not the identities of your fellow players. Unfortunately, aliens will know who their compatriots are, so you'll be at a bit of a disadvantage, humans. By my calculations, you will have 15 minutes before I cease to be, so I'd appreciate it if you could figure out who the aliens are, and then push the button. You will be our first captain. I have repurposed the ship's quarters into unique testing areas. You can be impressed now. Choose an available room and your desired participants. Welcome to the Deliberation Deck. Humans will be given a difficult decision and must choose which answer seems appropriate to them. Aliens will see no dilemma and must choose their answers blindly. When the crew sees the full statement, aliens may have to justify their random selection or face suspicion. Let's see what these players choose. If they're an alien, I bet it's peculiar. Humans received the following prompt. A ten-year-old eats a supermarket grape without paying. What you should do is... And now the participants' uh, answers. One grape. Yeah. Do any of these answers seem suspicious? Um, now you have to decide who's an alien, or just makes terrible life decisions. Talk to each other and find the truth. But remember, two among you are aliens and will be lying. Okay, next captain, you're in charge. Okay, let's get a move on. Pick another room and test group. There's less than 14 minutes. Welcome to the Opinion Hold, a place to hang out and let your opinions fly. Each participant will be presented with a bold statement. You will then provide your level of agreement or disagreement. Aliens, however, will be given a completely different statement. When the crew sees the full opinion, aliens may have to justify an outlandish position. Let's see what these players have to say. Humans received. I'm superstitious. Do any of these seem stinky? Look for someone answering out of character, or just start yelling at each other. Uh-oh. It seems I've underestimated the alien virus's capabilities. Aliens now have the ability to hack the prompts. When looking at their probe screen, an alien can select any human and secretly give them the alien prompt. To make things worse, aliens can help other aliens by secretly giving them a human prompt. I hope you got all of that, because there's no way I'm repeating it. Okay, next captain, you're in charge. Welcome to the writing pod. You will be given a fill-in-the-blank prompt. Answer honestly, because it will be scrutinized. The alien virus will allow the intruders to get something similar, but not quite right. When the correct prompt is revealed, 
It will be up to you to determine if any seem odd. As time winds down, I'll do my best to send the aliens some real stinkers. It's the least I can do. And the prompt for humans was... A good activity for a first date would be... Okay, what can we harp on? Look for any written answer that doesn't seem quite right. And don't forget to hit that suspicion button. And don't forget about those alien hats. A smart alien can make someone look suspicious by flipping their prompts. Look at your device. You can now push the button and take us to the extraction room. But I would recommend you only do this once you're confident in your suspicions. Okay, next captain, you're in charge. A good activity for a first date would be... Yes, it's activity. It's an activity. I guess. I don't like how you say Keep an eye out for my pet dog. Ah, another trip to the opinion hold. Keep your eyes peeled for any out of character responses. And the human prompt was I could fix a broken washing machine. Do any of these answers what seem the suspicious? Fuck? Oh, no! Do you think you could fix a broken washing machine? Fuck no. I think I could, probably. Depending what it is, if I use it to drill, yeah. I've tried to fix everything. Uh, we saw it on Modern Family where Phil was getting crazy for fixing the dryer. The bioscanner is now online. If the team you send there oh, passes a test, you'll be broken, able to I analyze mean, I, any I player and find out if they're an alien. The okay, the next alien captain, you're in charge. Yeah, All the hoses are out of place. Like, I'm thinking like the entire thing. Maybe, but nobody does strongly agree. Like, if we talk about the squirty squirt from the fabric. Okay. Teleporting to the writing pod. Let's see if there's any weird responses. Let's see the human prom. Why are you laughing at me? A profession I'd like to try for one day is... Let's obsess. Did you put that? I don't know. Actually, that would be really fun for one day. Not gonna lie. Just to see what it's like. Because everyone always talks about it. And you just do it the same way. Yeah. And plus, I'm too chunky anyway. So... I think you can keep the job. I mean, there's a market for everything, so... What? Tesla, what are you talking Next working captain, Tesla? please. You could work with Tesla, but that's what he Tesla. The question easily could have been what's your favorite brand? Because that was a pick. Because I, I could have put, put Google, but it should have been. Oh, you know we should not be in here. What are you doing? Excuse me, ma'am. This is the bioscanner. Unfortunately, the virus has got this place pretty screwed up. Participants will see a set of alien glyphs on their device. The captain will only see three glyphs and must describe them out loud. When three glyphs are tapped, the captain can lock in. If the glyphs match, the test will pass. The captain will then be able to learn one player's secret identity. But watch out, aliens may fail by tapping the wrong glyph on purpose. Captain, I'm sending you the correct glyphs now. I 
or something. Thank you. No, I'm The test has failed. Okay, that was suspicious. Maybe test humans next time. What was it? Oh, two and an octopus looking thing? Yeah, okay, so... I was close. But I didn't know what octopus thing you needed. I should have stayed with my regular place. We're on the clock here, people, so let's keep it going. Oh, I don't know. I guess you would have said it's octopus or dogs. No, all these are fine. I can see an octopus in there. Yeah, the log is the octopus. This virus is getting on my nerves. Let's figure this out. Next, Captain. So, who's so savage? Welcome to the drawing quarters. You'll be given a prompt to draw. Draw it the best you can because the alien virus will give our intruders a similar yet different prompt. When the drawings are revealed, cast suspicion on any you find to be a bit off. As time goes on, I'll do my best to send the aliens harder prompts. You're welcome. No, not Mario. It's supposed to be fun. Why do we get coffee? Or else you just know automatically you're like, oh, you're gonna get coffee. Like, you just know what it's not as fun. Because if you're an alien and you're everyone already knows you. Did I mention that if humans use all of their button pushes without success, you lose? Well, you oh, do. Wait, okay. Here is the human prompt. Draw yourself in the future. What do we think? Keep in mind, someone may have gotten a bad prompt. Or, they could just be a terrible artist. I mean, the suspenders and the top hat is kind of fun. Yeah, wait, no, Cody's skin is smart, I think. Wait, I thought Cody was Pyro. Skid Mar Mar Skid McMars is a Spyro character, but you wouldn't know. Unless it's a Spyro. Wait, no, that's a Ratchet and Clank character. I don't know. Hey everyone, if a player seems to be taking wit- Next captain, you're on the clock. Another trip to the opinion hold. Keep your eyes peeled for any out of character responses. Humans received the following prompt I cry at least once a week. And go. Okay, if you're so McTavish, that can be both true and untrue. So I am stuck. I'd say on average it comes back to one, once a week, I guess. Because you cry when you look at the screen at night. Yeah. So I could let you get rid of that. Otherwise... But I'm also like crybaby. You get crybaby at certain points, yeah. New captain. Selected. Let's 
see if there's any weird responses. It's worth mentioning that hack number is the number they start with, not how many they have. Humans got... The best TV theme song is... Anything odd? Welcome to the extraction room. I bypassed some subroutines to stop the timer. What's that? Sorry, I thought someone actually thanked me. Since you were the one to push the button, isolate the two crew members you believe are aliens and press confirm. Since this is our first time here, you have two minutes to decide. Now the non-isolated member shall vote. If you all vote yes, and these players are aliens, yes, then the humans and moi are safe. But if one of them is a human, then it's curtains for us all. Okay, time to vote. The vote has to be you. The vote passed. Uh -huh. Humans win. You turned on each other, but you did it the right way. Hey, Layla, why'd you put silent screen? What was the prompt for that? Because, but they couldn't really think about it because of the... Oh? Oh! The delay's not the cover. Can you check the cover? The delay's been really bad. Can you say it too? The hacks are on their own though, not the game itself. Yeah, but when I click something to put the people in the room, you usually tap them to use the hack on them. Uh -oh. Excuse me. Oh, oh Layla, it said favorite sad song. Doesn't have a uh, kind of timer. Okay, so just not this one again? We never had that issue before. That's weird. Cause Sorry, on the, is there settings on this part? Uh, it's in each one individually. But now I have it on the ones that I always have it. It's usually the thing I do whenever you I go into it. Oh, wait a second. I want to press back. I haven't done this. Going up the list. Why don't you just hit the word settings? No, I guess I can. Yeah, no, whatever this is, I'm timer. Like, that's the first thing you want to do. I downloaded it. Checked it. I have a sign. 
around like this. I tested it before we started. It was like five, five or ten seconds. Uh, not five or ten seconds. Less than ten seconds. Yeah, that's pretty good. Did y'all get your new internet yet? The way I know that one I did my test, it was like my new.
Bonjour, hello, salut, yesas. Welcome to the Dictionarium. Leave your cares at the door, and if you don't mind, also your clogs. Check out this crew. Very nice. In the Dictionarium, you will collectively create a dictionary entry for a fictitious word. May the funniest answers win. Oh, P.S. Feel free to join the audience. Enter the room code to play along. Let us begin. First things first, I am assigning you a word. Write a definition for this word on your device. I found this word written on the bottom of my kayak. I saw it after I emerged spluttering from the surface of the ocean. I capsized after running my kayak into a blue whale, who at first I thought had passed away. But actually, she was giving birth. And the birth was beautiful, and it was a wonderful opportunity to witness motherhood and connect with an animal. Anyway, that's the context of where I found this word. If you can't think of a word, just make a juicy vowel sandwich. Give me a hot tip. It's called Brandon. I'm talking to myself like any sane person would. I'm absurdly happy we got that magic word in fact. That one on the song. For the love of dog, submit now! I think so, yeah. That word is one of the best times in my On par with some of those things. Okay, let's see them. <laughs> Voting time! Choose the definition that fits the word like a glove. Personally, I would never wear gloves because I don't want my hands to think I'm ashamed. And remember, you can award bonus points to the ones that stole your heart. Official note take backs definition for the word is. <laughs> Next up, you're going to think of a new word that fits the definition you just voted on. In other words, you're coming up with a synonym. Write down a fresh new word to pair with the fresh new definition on your device. This is a quick round. Quick round. Away, so submit your synonym. I want to see these words. Pick the word that makes the most sense with this definition. Ah. It's dead.
and the official synonym that is replacing our old word is... I like that one more. I voted for it. I voted for it too. What? I think Lalo might be winning this. Now we have a brand new word There's and definition. Yeah, Let's so use it. Write a sentence using the word on your device. I hereby sentence you to writing a sentence. Hee hee hee. I am thrilled to present your sentences. Now let's vote. And the most favorite oh. sentence is... <laughs> How perfect is this entry in the Dictionarium? You've made history, big dogs. Yeah, oh, big and dog. now we get to see who won. <laughs> Play again. A new word just got tangled in my bangs. The game that you are playing, well, it causes much hilarium. You make up silly words and phrases ending in hysterium. You have to answer quickly. No, you really mustn't carry them. And anybody can compete a Tom, a Dick, a Harriam. So gather in the living room, pull up a stool or chariot with lots of foods and beverages like milk or juice or barium. Then start to make your crazy words and don't forget to vary them. And that is how you win a dictionarium. Dictionarium, dictionarium, with words you will not find. <laughs> You look so sad. Why you look at him? Hysteria. Hello there, test subjects. Sign in with the room code, then take a picture or draw yourself for our records.
Owl is probably... Welcome to Role Models. We put the social in social science, and we also put the science in it. Here at the lab, we've spent years. Skip the formalities. Got it. Everyone vote for the category that looks the most interesting, preferably something you all know a bit about. You're Justin Timberlake. Which I'm YouTube rabbit there. hole are you most likely to fall down? I'm <laughs> so, on your device, you've got the names of your fellow lab rats. Drag each one to the role you think fits them best. That includes yourself. Oh, and you'll see a little 99% sign next to each roll. Tap that to lock in the answer you're 99% certain will match what everyone else picks. I'll make it worth your while if you're right, so make sure to pick someone. When everyone's given out their roles, we'll check out the results. I really should. Let's look at those votes. Take out the that outliers. We have I mean, our I winner. I like to reward my lab rats for positive behavior, so I'll give but you guys you these nutritious the science show. pellets. Whenever your answers match the group, yeah, whoever has the most at the end is my lab rat of the month. Plus, they're oh. delicious. Yeah. Three of us, you really know yourself, or at least what your friends think of you. That 99% guess paid off. You like this role, you really like this role. The truth is out there. Maybe. And your 99% guess was 100% right. Last one picked for a roll, huh? We've all been there. I've got a consolation roll that might do the job. Everyone vote on which role this controversial subject ah! deserves. <laughs> At least you got something. And this role comes with some science pellets. Cody, can you just stop? That's the lineup. And here's how many science pellets everyone has. Remember, you get pellets when your answers match the group or you perform the best in a tiebreaker experiment. Oh, Keep that in mind if you want to beat your fellow guinea pigs. Okay, what's next?
my vote in there just for the rest of the people. Uh, it doesn't even matter. Alright, people, lock in. Which classic film hero are you? Assign those roles. And don't forget to tap that 99% next to the role you're most sure about. Everyone picked. Yeah, we all knew that. Hey, you got the role you wanted. I didn't know because I was Googling. I thought John Shock was. But if anybody asks if you are, say no. Subjects who already have a role yeah. don't need another one, so let's yeah. lose these votes. You're damn right. Hey, my John and my Jack. These subjects are tied. Let's fix them. Who would be the best dinner date? Vote on your devices now. The subject with the most votes gets the role. Okay, I'm gonna really get it. I'd have dinner with either of them. Yes, I would have dinner with either of them, but if I had to choose one of them. And Layla gets really awkward and doesn't talk, so just the I don't do the food Cody would get into a pretty deep conversation if the conversation was good enough. Same could be said for Layla. I think Layla can like Cody would have a steak or something. Oh, so you're going for a food? I want yeah, a conversation because I hate, I hate quiet dinner. But Cody also hates eating around people. And also, Layla and I can make it easy together. I'm gonna be the day ending. Fuck, the two of them are the Cody would be here. fun for a movie. Uh, I'm really trying to like remove any sort of. Well, actually, there isn't any virus here. That's a hard choice. The process works. And I'll reward your behavior with some science pellets. You belong in a museum. I guess so can be All right, we've got our lineup. Oh, and you? You are scary good at this. Do you want a job? Okay, I feel like I'm getting to know you guys, so let's see if I can do anything with the data we have so far. Your roles tell me that you're polar opposites, at least in this one extremely specific way. We're gonna pit you against each other and see who wins. I agree with this. What is the least secure password you can think of? I want oh. both of you to write an answer that really plays up the characteristic above you. The rest of you will decide who wins. I think Layla's Oh, your birthday. Be, I know what Layla's gonna be. And then Kyle's gonna be. Birthday? There you have it. I called it! Vote on your devices now. 
Yeah, I got it exactly. Lale went a little too smart for me though. So Cal wins. Least secure password you can think of. One, two, three, four, four, three, two, one. I wouldn't guess that the first time it comes. I wouldn't think of doing it first. Yeah, but that she's smart, so I think that is pretty good. That's that. Cal's just straight up foolish. Lilith is smart, but it's a smart You two. Smart, not a Your rules tell me you've got something smart. in common. I can't stand not knowing who's better. If you had a superpower based on one of your talents, what would your superhero name be? Answer the prompt on your devices, and we'll settle this once and for all. So we got Arctic and Lightning. Power. Yeah, I power based on one of your talents. Or Dino Fish. That's what we're working with. Vote on your devices now. Creator is actually pretty badass. Yeah. Yeah. Creator, I uh, thought actually be a pretty that that's a superhero name that was probably good. Super that settles that. Wow. This will be our last category, so choose wisely. Game of Thrones characters. Let's get into the movie. Yeah, that's fine. I know Bob Who is Ned Stark? Which Game of Thrones character fits you best? Let the truth telling begin. Read the room on that. Gonna need more data to settle this tie. What? Why am I curious? Finish this statement. That's what I do. I drink and I... Write your answer on your device. Your fellow lab rats will decide whether you get the role. Even if you're not sure you want the role, I'm handing out science pellets to the winner. So do your best. It's an experiment, man. You think rats always want to run the maze? Thank <laughs> you. 
That's what they came up with. Put on your devices now. <laughs> That's all I can think of. In science, we call that a shutout. Ah! 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 Hey, I'm sure you had your reasons. You probably don't want this role. Here's where we ended up. One last thing before we close the book on this experiment. Let's see what else we can determine from your roles. You guys. Your roles tell me you share a common personality trait. Which is cute and all, but there can be only one. If there was a game show based on a physical challenge you could always dominate, what would it be? Answer the prompt on your devices, and we'll settle this once and for all. Here it is. Vote on your devices now. I mean, can I just say anyone? Pretty badass that you did do that. I think Kai would have. Kyle Terry Cruz, hello. Kai would dominate. The results are in. You guys, your roles tell me you share a common characteristic. You guys are like twins, but one of you has to be better. If you had unlimited funds for a one hour shopping spree, what would you buy? Answer the prompt on your devices, and we'll settle this once and for all. Devices now. So I was up my brain. Oh, damn. So I would do that. I thought it was that. That would be a neon taskmaster. Like, come back, go to whatever story you have. Yeah, I'd call that pretty Double conclusive. <laughs> the final piece of data. Allow me to present your final roles determined by everything your fellow guinea pig said about you. Annoying and adventurous hero. Not very stylish and spiritual detective. Extremely brave, not so smart martial artist. Extremely aggressive, stylish, super fashion icon. And our lab rat of the month with the most total science pellets is... Fairly brave, not very violent, super scatterbrained, only one of those is right. I think they only got one right on everybody. <coughs> Wait, what's Cody's again? No, our team and Cody's all wrong. Not very adventurous. Uh, hero. Was that? Hero's okay. I think you're okay. Nom nom nom. Hey, Cody, you got one now. What one's the next one? Everyone's favorite?
Five round back. Can we do some? Well, I guess on this one, no, do two rounds, but I like two rounds then. Where is my popcorn now? Cody can twin. We all read it that way. Welcome to my game that I won't bother telling you the name of because you turn tutorials off. First question. Where was Transylvania? China. Use your device to answer the question. <laughs> and the correct answer is... Who got the question right? Well, that sucks. Let's try another one. What is modern day Persia called? <laughs> Who picked this? Really? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. I want to show you something. Welcome to room 113. The hair dryer's broken, sorry. It's the classic oh, no. game, chalices. Half of these chalices are poisoned. Pick a chalice to drink from. If you want to survive, I pick a cup with no poison. Mm. Now let's see what everyone drank. Oh, good. Wow. You trusted your poor instincts. Cody. <laughs> this elevator's a real death trap. For real, though. Let's keep moving. Who has been on the cover of Vogue the most times? One of you is still alive. Come with me. I'm sure. Welcome back to the killing room. This one lets you protect yourself with the password. Enter a real four-letter word with your device. Don't make it easy. If someone cracks your password, you die. Or link. Or tingle. Link, link, two, two, link, one, two, three, four, link, two. Hurry up. Mm. Dunk. Now Dunk. everyone else will try to crack the password. Run. As a team, guess the password on your device. You get a clue if your guess has a letter in the right spot. If anyone figures out the password before time runs out, Easy, I will water. reward you all. Oh. 
This is a team effort, so share clues out loud with each other. Uh, T blank P E. What's the opposite of a firewall? Because that's you. The final round isn't ready yet. Charlotte You're not all Charlotte supposed Charlotte to die before that. Hey, wake up! You were having a horrible dream where you died before getting to the final round. That won't happen again. It's time for the next question. Which of these book sequels is not real? This. Only a ghost got it wrong. Lucky guesses. Let's try another one. Who built the Pyramid of the Sun? Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. It's magic time! Pick a space inside the box to hide. I would say don't get too comfortable, but I feel like that's obvious. Now I'm gonna need some volunteers. Good news, I'm giving you a sword. On your device, choose a row or a column to run your sword through. I like to call this trick, Abracostabra. Oh, the sun came up. Sword noise! Ah, I hope that was me. Ooh, I needed that! You messed it up again? Fine, you don't get my super cool final round. Wait, what? <laughs> what? No, there's no one allowed to run it. Okay. I think we have... Well, I'm just going to do it, but whatever. Okay, first question. In Norse mythology, what will happen during Ragnarok? Use your device to answer the question. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? The rest of you, time for consequences. Welcome to room 105. Ah yes, tattoos. 
Where I promise I won't pass out this time. Create a new tattoo on my back by drawing on your device. so excited about oh, my cool well, new look. Now vote for your favorite cat. Hi, yo. The artist with the fewest oh. votes will die. What did we decide? This ink has got to go. What? I will have my revenge. <laughs> I probably should have set this whole game up on the first floor now that I think about it. Well, you live and you learn. Oh, Let's keep yeah. moving. Yeah, that, that skin I feel dumb for asking this, but... What is hummus? Oh, I know what the hummus is. This. Yeah, Which God. leaves only you. It's time. Ah. Welcome to room 237. Time to be subjected to the loser wheel. <laughs> Give it a spin. <laughs> What's fun about this is that the odds are clearly really bad. Well, the loser wheel's gonna loser wheel, you know? I never thought I'd be back here running the old family murder hotel. I also thought I'd never own a pair of crops, but the blood just washes off so easily. Let's try another one. Which of these X's came first? Hmm. <laughs> Who picked this? The rest of you who are still alive, follow me. I'm feeling charitable. Give money to each other. The person with the most cash at the end will die. But if they end up with $800 or more, I will kill you instead. Begin. Let's track that cash. Too rich for your blood. We're here. When one player is left alive, we'll go to the final round. Next question. How are you and me beating everyone else? How many toes does a pig have on each hoof? Uh... Who picked... this? What? I want to show you something. I just want to play Quiplash. 
I like fun things too. You know, fun things other than murder. The game will send a question to your devices. Enter the best answer you can think of and hit send. This timer is a little longer, so you can write. And it gives me a chance to take a bathroom break. Oh god, I'm gonna pee my pants. Let's see the funny ha ha's. The one defense that a jury always believes. Don't believe a word he says. He's crazy. All right, everyone else, vote for the answer ah. you like the best. The player who wrote the answer with the fewest votes dies. Let's see the votes. Okay. We have a loser. I got Cody's vote. Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Accurate, because I don't know what. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive. But will you be the one to escape? Here's your first category. Galaxies. Tap each answer that fits the category, and then press submit. Let's see the right answers. Fuck the brands. Time is almost up. I don't know if you can outrun those ghosts. Eat those common English letters. Fellowship members in Fellowship of the Ring. Time is almost up. Mm, you stole some yummy life force. Don't look behind you. It's only darkness. Animals statistically likely to outlive a moose. Time is almost up. Another life swap. Renaissance artwork. Mark Twain characters. That ghost can smell your life force. Countries bordering the Indian Ocean. Almost up. Uh, 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 not so fast. If you want to break through that barrier, you'll need a perfect answer to this question. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. Get all the right answers to escape. Oh, 
change his name from. I thought it was cute. I don't remember Does it? Yeah, I just always count the pointer. But it has that more than six. Yeah, but it only has six, so it wasn't one of the answers. The answer is only ten. Oh. But I always count the pointer, because in my head I was like, so this dude is a seven. Ah! <laughs> ah! That's why I lost. I thought. Because <laughs> elephants walk with their trunk. I mean, they could if they had you. If they had a leg injury or something, I'm sure they probably could, like, hobble with it. Maybe. Do I want to do it again? Not doing mosquito comment. No. I wanna I'm trying to be doing smash and finishing the painting. This one. We played everyone's favorite. We'll call out there. If anyone wants to play again, let me know. I'm just too tired right now. Like later. So you're gonna go paint? Or I, what are we gonna do it tomorrow? Um, uh, I don't know.